Okay. Let's try this again. Because I keep getting interrupted. Alright. Today I'm going to be reviewing the awesome game that is Zelda Skyward Sword. Oh my god. This game, Nintendo, they're good at what they're doing. They know what they're doing. So let's go with the graphics. The graphics always used to amaze me. Um, for what it's worth, uh, I'm going to give it a 9.5. Um, you know, the, Nintendo doesn't try to make their graphics as realistic as possible the way Microsoft and Sony try. But graphics, it, it still looks great. I love it. <clears throat> and I wouldn't have it any other way. It is different than what, you know, Twilight Princess. Um, it, it's, it's more cartoonish, but in a good way. Alright, so next let's go to gameplay. Gameplay, the mechanics are fucking awesome. They utilize the Wii Motion Plus capabilities very well. <clears throat> I love the, you know, the, the sword handling. It, it really does. It's that accurate to how you're, you're moving the Wiimote. And uh, way better than Twilight, by far. Hands down, way better than Twilight. Uh, the sound... Now, uh, the sound, it, it, it does have rich sound. The soundtrack is really awesome. And I'm probably going to pop it in right after this video because I feel like hearing it. Um, they, they know, N N Nintendo did a very good job of putting a lot of the sound effects in the right places. The music was... It, it fit the the scenarios, the, the the backgrounds, the themes, you know. So overall, um, oh, forgot to give the gameplay a, a gameplay. I give it a perfect ten. Gameplay is a perfect ten. Sound, I'm gonna give the sound a nine because I mean, yeah, like it's not HD, and that's the only thing that's hindering it. And oh, and I hate this. I hate this day and age where everything has to be in fucking HD. You know, because we're all spoiled like that. Spoiled fucking Americans. Um, so next, let's go to the the replay value. The replay value, I'm going to give it a 10 for two reasons. One is that um, it has, I mean, it, it, it's just that fun where you want to keep playing it. You know, especially beating it that's one you know and, and and me personally in every Zelda game that I've ever played I have to get everything I have to get all the all the bugs I have to get every heart piece I have to get you know the the best weapons and all the the extra secret weapons and whatnot armors I just have to get all that it's 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 in my blood and the second reason is that um, not like the storyline is just so awesome that I want to revisit it and play it again. And you know, and now they added a hero mode, which I, I guess the closest thing to it would have been the the Master Quest in Ocarina of Time. Uh, but in this one, not uh, yeah, hero mode like everything is harder. You know, you 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 take more damage, you do less damage, I believe as well. So, all in all, as a wrap-up, Skyward Sword, I give it a 9.5 overall. It's just that amazing of a game. It really is. Um, would I go as far as to say as it is better than Ocarina of Time? Yes, I will go as far as saying that. In my opinion, Blackheart's opinion... This is a better game than Ocarina of Time. And I know you guys are just going to shit all over me for it, but that's just me. Um, so this is Blackheart saying peace the fuck out.